So let's talk uh, 13 Lives. Yeah. So this was a amazing movie. It was a powerhouse movie. And if anyone's not seen it, it's available now on Amazon. So yeah, it's uh, just recently come out in the, in the cinemas over here. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, um, wow. Ours went right to Amazon. It was showing, I think, in a couple major cities in New York City and LA. But other right. than that, it went right to Amazon Prime. Yeah, I mean, um, sorry, what, Stephanie, just one, 10 sure. seconds. Cinema is basically one of the ma major cinemas over here. Uh huh. And they, ha they are holding a, a showing for, and I think they're selling tickets and all the, all the proceeds will go towards um, Ja Saman, who, who passed away during the rescue. Oh, and, that's amazing. Um, so all the proceeds will be going to his family. Oh, wow. That's so nice. From what I've, from what yeah. I've, um, from what I've heard. Yeah. Yeah. Which is um, nice. That's really nice. You should sneak into the theater and sit in the back. And sit. Me, oh, I've seen it quite a few times now. So yeah, um, um, yeah. <laughs> you, I know you went to the premiere in Bangkok in the beginning of August with the other Thai cast. Like watching yourself on screen. Um. Well, to be honest with you, I mean, it's it was quite funny it's because like, um, I'm talking in English, but I'm not. I'm saying like you know in in a Thai accent, so it's funny for me. And it's like, what are you doing, Peter? Hey guys, I'm sorry, but we will have to walk from here. Yeah, that like, accent was <laughs> that accent was funny. That accent was really funny. exactly. <laughs> and I did that accent. I do that <laughs> accent to, to um, you know, what's the word to make, you know, take, make fun out, uh, you know, Thai people speaking English sometimes <laughs> because, you know, my dad's Thai and, and that's how he spoke. So ever since I was young, I yeah. was doing that, you know? <laughs> um, so, so, and then this... I did that in the audition as well. And they loved it. I did it for a laugh. Yeah, <laughs> and it sold, and it sold. And it sold, yeah. What was it like the first day walking onto this set for 13 Lives? Was it like a big Hollywood movie set? It was daunting. Um, yeah. It was in the junk one. <laughs> Not jungle. Australians don't have jungle, do they? Uh, a replica uh, of the cave. Set. Yeah. 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 Exactly. And um, there was like at least two, three hundred people there, including all the team and the cast and the, the extras and all everything. Um, mm -hmm. So. The, the person who brings me on set, you know, they say, oh, P Peter, we're ready for you. And, you know, I'm walking there. I'm like, oh, my God. I haven't even met anyone yet. Yeah. No one's, <laughs> no one's introduced me. Oh, what am I going to do? And uh, so they're like, oh, okay, there's Ron. And Ron's amazing. You know, he's a really nice guy. Um <laughs> Yeah, I was going to ask you if you felt starstruck. I mean, it's Ron Howard, incredible um, director. No, I sp I've spoken to him a few times prior to that already, so I wasn't really. But yeah, I mean, to see him face to face was. I was still like, "Hi, sir." <laughs> Hi. It's Ron <laughs> Howard. <laughs> it's me, Peter. Yeah. <laughs> and. Um, Oh, the, the thing is, like, Ron remembers my name. So, you know, when, when you know, you have Ron Howard remembering, remembering who you are is like... I mean, that's wow, epic. Okay. Yeah. 
and Peter, you're on set now. And yeah, there's Vigo. Um, and I'm like, what, what, what? <laughs> hi, 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 Mr. Vigo. You know, that kind of thing. Are you a Lord of the Rings fan? Uh, I like Lord of the Rings, yes. Uh, I've watched all three. Yes. Um, I've also watched Colin Farrell's movies, you know. I I thought he was going to be a bit boisterous and, you know, brash. And, but he's not. He's he's amazing and very, very funny person. Uh, um, great sense of humor. Both of them, everyone, really. My first scene, I went into the scene. I had to say a few things about uh, the mountain. Because my that brain was the scene that was like gushing down on us. Oh, which is wow. level five, like the strongest rain. So it's like a storm pretty much. And um, you're in a hurry. So I went into the scene. I was like, "How am I gonna, how am I gonna say this this line, this particular line?" Mm. You know, I'm now practicing in my accent. And hello, <laughs> yes, you know, yeah, <laughs> <laughs> this is Nang Non Mountain. Yeah, that stuff. And so I was like thinking in my head. And but when I got to the scene, and then you have all this rain. You know, I didn't even think about what I planned or how I was going to play. I was just like, this is Nang Nong Mountain. Yeah, yeah, yeah let's yeah. go. Princess. They said that her tears trapped the boys. The sleeping princess is angry. Angry? What's she angry about? I don't know. It's just what the local people say. <laughs> <laughs> and it's well, cold as well. It's cold, yeah. One of... Um, the things that I learned about this film that was really moving is that like during this rescue, there was over yeah. 10,000 people that actually helped in the rescue. And yeah. that was quite moving to really show the heart and spirit of Thai people. I had no idea like the farmers gave up their land and, and everybody was so involved in this. So it was a really good story to tell, I think. Yeah, I mean, you know, I, I think it would happen anywhere in the world, you know. 10 kids are, or, you know, 13 lives are in the cave, you know, and they're young, young lives, you know. I think in any, any part of the thing, mm -hmm. they would do it, you know. I mean, I'm yes. sure it's special. Uh, yeah. Um, but I'm sure, like, 13 lives for sure in america people would do the same you know yeah the thing that was i would hope so <laughs> I hope, we hope i i want to believe that they would I, I think they would i think they would so um when you were there uh on location you were in queensland which is so beautiful there uh and you posted some videos um with the cast bonding what kind did you guys get to see anything on your downtime when you weren't filming did you get to go out and explore uh, to like you know where where all the surfers are and the big waves and so you cool. know, uh, went crabbing we went crabbing um which Crab. is basically go, going on a boat and they get grabbed catch crabs oh that's yeah. so cool say that again we went to theme parks theme park okay are we back oh you got it yeah got it got it now oh. hey. <laughs> technical difficulties okay right so yeah. where were we um 